Now, what are the cases that are set for in favor of globalization? It is said that it would help in more effective allocation of resources, whether it is your human resource or your natural resource or your other resources, they will be used in a more effective way. It will reduce the capital output ratio, the ratio between the capital that is invested, the money that is put in and the output that will become more favorable at less capital, we will be able to produce more, the labor productivity will go up and it will obviously create more employment opportunities. More people will come up, they will open their firms, they will open their industries, more employment opportunities would be create, created. It will also restructure the production and the trade pattern. The production patterns will change, the technology will improve because when we say the foreign capital comes in, it is not only the money that comes in, the technological know-how also comes in and that also has a large impact on the production processes. Foreign capital will also be attracted. The industrial sector will also feel the impact. It will grow better and with the help, when there is foreign competition, the domestic industry also, in order to compete, their quality also goes up their quality is improved and they perform better. The domestic industry also grows if the conditions are favorable. It may happen the other way around also, but if the government is a little cautious, then the foreign competition makes the domestic industry to prosper as well. The cases that are against globalization is that it redistributes economic power at world level. When obviously the, it is an open forum and every, every country is coming in, then the countries that are developed, that are more strong, that are leaders, the, the world economic leaders, they will lead the world economy and economy and political powers are closely interlinked. Why is US a political as well as an, because it is good, the economy is good, it is an economic leader, that is why. Politically also, it is a strong nation. So, for that purpose, it is also very important that the political power, uh, there is a strong leadership. Otherwise, we will be, again, go back in the eras of 1940s, where only the foreign power would be ruling us. So, it redistribution of economic power at the world level. And because it has given rise to so much of competition, and instead of coming together, it is more of moving away from one another. It has increased the pressure on the economies in order to perform and uh, fight with the foreign competition to give uh, a, to fight with the foreign competition. The pressure has increased on the domestic industries, and obviously, it has helped more the developed countries than it has helped the developing countries. They are the leaders. They are the economic powers. They are the leaders in economic powers, so it has helped them more. They have expanded their business and their business has grown more than it has helped us. So these are the cases against globalization.